All right. You're with Al and the Biff. Paul Waring, for <laughs> sake. <laughs> yeah, but everyone's heard of the Biff. No one's yeah, heard of Paul Waring. And this is Chronicles of a Not Yet Champion Golfer. We've been playing this game. Like most times when we've come out and played, we've booked early tee times because you know, most go golf courses, golf courses. It's called the golf course. <laughs> Most golf courses have been like rammed because people are keen to get out, understandably. So we booked early tee times. We come out and we play nearest the pin game. So it's literally whoever gets their approach shot closest wins the point. So it puts pressure on your tee shot to go to get in position to actually hit a shot close. Stay, stay right, stay right a bit. Do that every time. No, <laughs> not a good start. And then. It puts pressure on that shot because you can't really halve the hole unless you're exactly the same distance away from the hole, which is unlikely. So The only uh, situation is if you both miss the green, then obviously wherever your chip's from, it's then nearest the pin from that position. So it's, uh, I mean, it's good. Uh, you literally you it feel sounds, it on every shot. It sounds really simple, but the amount of times I've stood there with a wedge just going, hit the green, hit the green, hit the green, because it doesn't matter. If it's literally eight foot away and on the fringe, it doesn't count. It's got to be on the green. So we're going to do it over five holes today. We normally play 15 holes and do it in three sets of five. That way, if someone's five nil up, you've still got a chance to go ahead and do it. Which actually, in the first game we played, you were five nil up after five. Yeah, I lost. Yeah, and you lost. I won. Just that's why I said it, really. Thanks. What's the score in the series? It's 2 1 to you. Thanks. So that's what we're doing. Five holes. Playing the 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th and finishing up with a little par 3, 16th at Bromborough. It's had a bit of rain, which is nice actually recently. So I've got the early detection warning system here as well. Yep. Hasn't got his hat on. I always forget my hat. No sponsor job. You right. Yours on. I've got my bag. Force You've got bag. your bag, yeah. Oh, yours turned a lot. It's windy though, isn't it? Yeah, it's windy off the right there. Okay, pitch it close under the tree. It's so bad, just make sure it doesn't hit the tree. Oh, thank you. See, now all he has to do is hit the green. Just make sure it doesn't hit that tree. How far have you got? 77. Club have you got? 60. Shall I land it on the top? I'm going to fly up the top of that ridge. Well, it's a rubbish pitch. 1-0. That's the thing with the game. You play the sh first shot, you can either... You've played the wrong ball. You've played the wrong ball. <laughs> You've actually played wrong ball. There's his ball. I didn't think you were that far left. <laughs> it's 1-0 the wrong way round. I can't, no. Go on, play that one. I can't have that. It's not a scoring, scoring game. I didn't think you were that far left. I didn't even check it, I just literally played the shot. <laughs> How far have you got? 60. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That is funny, that is a point of contention. I'm gonna bring that up at the end if I don't manage to win some more. It's lovely. Right, you can have that. You can have it, considering I'm in the bunker. <laughs> would you have given him the point or would you have claimed it? Could get a bit of a mixed response, that. <sighs> Didn't really test him. If I did a decent shot, it might have been all right. But if you hit it close, you put him under pressure. But if you don't hit it close when you're first to play, it makes it so easy. Just got to hit the green. One nil down. Harrington was saying when we spoke to him, he always tries to get it as close to the green as he can because the short game's so good. But in this game, obviously, if you can get it within 30 yards of a green, you've got more chance of hitting it close. Even if you don't hit a great shot from 30 yards, you can hit a good shot from 100 yards, you won't get it as close. So there's a big premium on getting it close. So we're taking it on straight into win, though. We can't get up, can we, today? It's a good hit. Oh, that's a great ball as well. That is a great ball. I don't know why I'm looking, I can't see a thing. I haven't got my glasses on, my eyes are like 
so lazy in the mornings. Can you move so I can hit me shot? That is a very good shot. Thank you, appreciate that. See, if he wings it right there. He's getting severed iron out. Yeah, literally, yeah. <laughs> it just hit the fairway, but the fact that he's at a good one now puts me under pressure. Very good under pressure, though. Very good under pressure. <laughs> oh, just feel like I'm fighting golf swing all the time. Have you done any work with Trapman recently? You know I have. <laughs> <laughs> got obsessed. He's got obsessed with Trapman. Got obsessed. Uh, what happened to my Trapman, by the way? The Trackman's in like a little like uh, kind of wetsuit material case but it unzips all the way around so it was unzipped on the top and then i went to unzip it but because it was already a little bit unzipped i held it by one handle and the weight of the track man kind of made the whole thing unzip fell out hit the uh hit the floor in the garage and cracked the corner of the plastic at the front honestly honestly i i, I knelt on the floor I left the track man where it was and I knelt on the floor with my head in my hands. You know, it's like, you know, if you drop your phone and you like pick it up and you're thinking, I don't want to look at this. That's what it was like. And then I switched it on and it still worked, which is a bonus, really. So, Soz. You owe me a track man. That's why I feel a little bit anxious today and why I've just hit one drive left and one drive right. Also, he hasn't just broken a track man. He also fell off his bike. Yeah, I fell off my bike. He's also it's better now, but I cut my hand on the gravel. He's also broke the tripod he's using. The tripod's broke out to super glue it, which has come off now as well, so. And I'm walking in from the golf club the other day, he walked into a car. Yeah, I was walking, walking, walking home. home. Like, didn't do any damage, but. Slammed my clubs into his mirror. So yeah, I've not had a good run of events really, so I don't know what I'm expecting from today. You've had a great drive there. I don't know if you followed it. We've played this game a few times on Instagram. And this green, like, we've been going long of it, haven't we? Because it's been so firm and it's not normally into wind. So it'll be a bit different playing it from 80 yards right. <laughs> I think I've hit it far enough right to have a shot. I just wanted to make sure I was keeping distance, mate. That's all. Certainly got that covered. I've actually got a shot, to be fair. Oh, the green keeper stopped from mowing the green. He's through there. I don't know if you can see the biff there. Hiya! There he is. I do feel the last couple of times I've come out, to be honest, I found myself getting like easily frustrated. And you know, through the whole channel, I kind of spoke about trying to be a bit, um, calm is difficult because it's kind of in my nature, but manage situations better. And I think that comes from being full routine and everything like that. And I feel like I've got out of it a bit on the golf course. So my acceptance isn't great. So I need to really, really pay attention to that. It's one area that I think I've sort of let slip a little bit, if I'm honest. I've got that sort of feeling inside, I'm like, oh, when I don't hit a perfect shot. I mean, we played the other day, me and Paul and I was, I was rubbish, like I hit it really rubbish. Um, but I got it, we only played nine holes. We had a game, he shot 32, so he beat me, but I shot 35, which is one under, which isn't good. But well, sorry, one under isn't bad, but my golf was terrible and I think, well, you know what, I'm getting it round now, like getting it up and down, which was something I wasn't doing ages ago. And that's something I've got to go in and go, well, it doesn't matter if I don't play great, because I can still get it round. The confidence is there then. And that's where this game's a bit different, because it kind of tests your ball striking. So you've got to get it close to the hole, so probably where I feel a little bit anxious. I don't want to lose another challenge. I'm not going to lose another challenge. Not to the biff. Not happening. 70 yards, it's lying quite nice into wind it's quite a nice yardage to be fair just gotta make sure there's enough speed to get it up but the wind will help that go 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 fatted it oh my god i fatted it i fatted it 
Oh, it's just no flow in the swing at all. It's not even a difficult shot, that. Right, get a grip of yourself, Al. 2 nil down. Like we normally have quite good games at this, but obviously I'm not quite showing that at the moment. Because it's over five holes, this as well, for the for the video. Could be a short video. <laughs> it's not going to be. Come on, get a grip. I didn't... Oh, oh, just hit me driver with the tripod now. Scratched it on the top. It's marked on the top. Oh, for... That's good, isn't it? Uh, I didn't even see your chip then. I'm assuming you hit the green. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> yeah, I hit the green. Did, uh, you did you? I didn't get over to you with the camera in time. I had, me, I had my hands at the time, so I just fatted a pitch. So. <sighs> Start again, Al. Reset, reset, routine. This is good now. This is what it's about. Puts you in a pressure situation this is what I want oh needs to stay left needs to stay left Is that right behind it I, th I think it's under it I, I think I could it was good it. shape it looked good I don't know it was a good shape talk about staying aggressive you like driver don't you I love yeah I love driver I like driver. No, no, no. I haven't liked driver. Past I liked it yesterday, yeah. Am I even recording right now? Yeah, I am, yeah. Might be alright. Hasn't hit anything. I could have carried that left side. Downwind, it just sort of started too far left, hasn't it? Uh, you know what? I haven't hit anything there. That's why the start lines are just inconsistent. Need to do more work on the track, man, mate. You can probably tell. And this, I'm not being negative. I'm not at all. I've decided to, like, try and continue working on some things because there's no tournaments in the near future, really, for me. It doesn't look like, anyway. So you can probably tell, swing-wise, I don't feel all that... Uh, I can't say not confident, but that kind of clear on the feelings over it and you can you know you're a little bit sort of caught in between certain shots and you can't quite see them it's kind of where I'm at it's not I'm not concerned like because I know I'll just do a bit of work and get back out on the course again that'll be fine but I'm just concerned that I don't want to lose this challenge where's your bushnell that might fall out oh. your bushnell might fall out there oh yeah saved you there might have broke your track man, but I saved your bushnell. I don't know which way around, I probably preferred it. Hmm. Can't have everything. Look, wildlife stop, look at him. Look at, he's big, isn't he? What is it, like a beetle? What are you even looking at? Him? You're off your head. Look at him, he's good, isn't he? Shall we play golf now? Oh, straight over the little ditch there, drainage shabby. Okay, I'm gonna carry on with my golf mate and find my ball up the left. Hopefully he's in the trees. This is one of the toughest holes in the course, isn't it? For what is it? 4.55? Downwind. Mine's alright by the way. I'm there. Got through the trees. There he is. Downwind helps. Where are you? Oh, I hope that's it behind that tree. Is that a ball? Mine's there. I've got a clear shot. Karma, mate, yeah? Shouldn't want to flick the beetle on you. What you were thinking? Oh, please be in the tree. This could be the change of fortunes I want. I mean, you know, granted sportsmanship, you shouldn't be happy when your opponent's in the rubbish, but I knew we wanted to flick that beetle, so I'm happy he's under the tree. Deserves it. Look at him. Look at him there. No. In the trees. And like it. Downwind, back pin. Can't go long. Pay attention. Always pay attention to where the pin is. White pin at the back. So we've got 160, but I cannot go past that because there's not much like room behind it all the room is in front of the pin so if i play this 155 i'm playing to a bigger part of the green i'm gonna hit nine nine it's actually a perfect spot for that pin here right i'm knackered behind a tree so if he just hits the green 
that's basically a point to him. It's fairly like shouting track man that's off his backswing then. That's the swing. Got it again. Got it again. Oh. Got it again. Go! I've got it again. I found it. That was control. And I've got this to play with now. Cheers. That's, that should do it, I reckon. I reckon I've got one back. 2-1 back in it. It only takes one shot to get you back in. I feel good again now. Controlled swing there. I've hit it to about 10 feet, I think. So... Well, I've got to try and just catch that left side, but I don't think I can because I'm going to back swing. You're not getting it close to the mine, are you? Well, no. Just don't. <laughs> Please. Yeah, one yeah the good. Two That's yeah, a little short. Good. Yeah, cheers. Yeah. Yeah, next. <laughs> <laughs> You've hit such a shit tee shot and I've munched mine behind a tree. If you swear quietly, it still sounds. <laughs> like mute yourself. To be fair, back right pin, up the left off the tee. Yeah, I did start it left, to be honest. I didn't need to start it that far left. But downwind, you're fine. You know you can get over those trees. Shouldn't bring that shot into play, mate. Bang online, exactly what I said about five yards short the pin. You don't want to go long. Can you see him? Up there. Yeah, nearly hold it. Doesn't matter though. Like, doesn't count, that. mate. Make four. Yeah, you've got it. Yeah. It doesn't make a difference. Like, it's, yeah. it's not part of the game. Doesn't count. Lucky. So there's the example of how it gets every part of the game. You know, a little bit off with your tee shot. And Paul couldn't hit the green. So it puts pressure on your tee shots. Then if you can get the green, it puts pressure on that. And you know, even mine, it was in good position. I still had to hit the green. There's never like a bit where you can kind of ease off unless like, the last two holes are quite short and you've got 30 yards and you're not really going to miss the green, are you? So, 2 1, we're back. I picked tough holes to do it on here. 434 straight into wind. Oh, it's on me, isn't it? It's on you. 2-1, it's tight down there as well, what are you thinking? I've only got a 21 with 3 iron, I haven't got 2 iron anymore. What about my 18? You've got 18 and 21? Yeah. You've got 15 clubs in your bag? I haven't, you I've must only have. got 3 wedges. It's annoying. I don't know, I think you're going to have to 3 wood. I don't know, I don't know Paul. Right. Low hooky one. Got three one written all over it. <laughs> yep. Yep. Don't seem to. I feel that. No, it's just started left again, on it. It's fine though. I know, but I just just the left start. It just it's says like left half. Yeah, but it just says everything that about your swing when you're not starting it online. Okay, we're all right. Am I being negative? I, yeah, yeah. I negative to, owls coming back. I don't want to be negative. Negative trackman owls coming out. It's not negative. It's just, uh, just standards. Say that. Say that. Oh, that ends up behind that tree again. It should be good. Do you think it's run out? I think that's run out. I was looking at the camera to be honest, I didn't really see. Hopefully it's gone behind the tree again then. I told you I was too far left. Oh, you're left though. Are you blocked out? A bit. I'm a little bit blocked out. I've got a shot. Are you glad you hit that 21, not the 18 now though, aren't you? <laughs> oh yeah, that's why you've run out. I should have hit three wood though. It's another back pin, I've got absolutely miles in. It's another three iron this. 227. Yeah, I wouldn't stand there. <laughs> got it the same shot, I've just hit off the tee there really. I've got to hit like a strong hook. Keep it low because I want it running, that's why I want draw, because that's when it's getting a bit of topspin. Run it up to the back of the green is the idea. 
I'm nervous. I need a win. I need to win. It's a bit high. I've ripped it though. Go, go. Just didn't get that sling on it. Just a bit short right. Yeah, it's all right, but it's just a bit high. I didn't keep it down. Hit it good. See that? I'm not that disappointed with that. That's like when I talk about not practicing those shots because we haven't been able to play that much. So I'm not overly fussed. I struck it good, felt like I swung it good. Just didn't get the shape I wanted. Oh, if he hits the green now, I've lost. He's yeah, if he hits the green here, I've lost. Hit the green to win. No. Oh no. How far? 202. In two on the right. Look, I can't get, I'm going to have to hit a bit of a sling around these trees here. Oh, have you got to hit a bit of a hook around them? Well, I can't, I can't launch it lower this one and get it over the next bush, so I've got to go around it, I think. 202. Go on, tell us how you're going to hit a hook then. What, you, what do you do? Do you just, I mean, I feel like a change in setup when I'm hitting a hook. Yeah. Make sure the club goes right. Literally just make sure it goes right. But what are you. I've been banging on that arc for ages, so I actually moved the ball a little bit further back in my stance to get it earlier on the arc, which actually creates a bit into out. Okay. Because if you think about the arc, it's back of the arc, so it's going that way anyway. Yeah, yeah, okay. Face. And also it helped me keep it down, hopefully, hit a bit of a low draw. Oh, that's not hooked enough. Ah. That stayed right. Don't even know where it's come down, but it stayed right. Is that tree in your mind? No, no. Tree in your mind? A little bit. It's just that one branch, sir. Horrible that. It's horrible that when you kind of think you can touch a tree on your backswing and you're not sure. Like this is why really you don't hit driver on this hole because it narrows so narrow. This fairway is probably like, what's that, 16 yards wide? Yeah, well it literally from this point it all slopes down as well. But if you're right side of the fairway, you're blocked up by those trees and it all slopes down. There's a ditch left, ditch right, so yeah, it's narrow. That's why the hole plays hard because really you can't, not hitting driver you know it's a big risk to hit a driver i know we spoke about getting it as close as you can so you give yourself your best chance of getting it close to the hole but there's a time when you've got to well, think you know what that risk is just not worth what you're getting out of it tee shot, it's automatic loss isn't it you know you've yeah. lost the hole haven't you so and from what you know if you can get it to if you hit driver there you got 160 in you know if you hit a good tee shot you got 200 in you just you difference in scoring from those yardages isn't going to be massive is it no. whereas your difference in scoring from 160 to 100 is going to be a big difference so you've got to pick and choose when you actually play aggressive and when you don't this isn't a hole to play aggressive on advantage me here oh. right first one that's down to short game waz is there i'm there yeah, it just well, come out straight, didn't it? Didn't get the hook like mine, really. But I've just avoided the trap, which is nice. I'm bustling this. 38 yards. It's a bit of breeze. I'd be quite aggressive with it. It's in a bit of an upslope. It's like a 40-yard feel, this one, for me. Right, come on, Wary. Lovely strike. Oh, 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 it's hot. It's stick a little bit more than that. Played it well. Oh, I've left the door wide open now, though. Needed it. You have, you have left door open, but in a bit of a hole here. It's uphill, into wind. I can be aggressive, I've got 50 degree. Try and hold it. Sit, sit, sit. Oh, funny bounce. It was a funny oh, bounce. That's you, good you. enough. That's good enough. Mate, it's so hard to focus properly. You're like, just get it closer, just get it closer. Thought I played that well. Oh, 
at two all. I am. I have played rubbish as well. How do you feel? Two all, and I have been rubbish. Huh? Not great. <laughs> one shot. A little bit. One hole. One shot. It's down to par three. 153 yards into wind. This is it. This is it. This is. This is so you keep saying this is it. It is it. This is it. This is what you work for. This, you don't practice for ages, mate. You practice for this. Oh, are you? 155, 7-iron. It's a strong wind, that. I'm going to play it. That's teed up like knitting three wood. <laughs> and it's 7-iron. Right edge of that trap and just going to fade it back. Ooh. Right, focus. Green. Not just hit the green. Double crossed focus, it. Focus on the shot you want to hit. Double crossed it. I've got this little bout to the left. No one cares. <laughs> what shot are you hitting? I've got a 7 iron. I've got a 65 shot. I think there's a good 10 of win there. What sort of trackman numbers are you looking for when you're hitting this shot then? Huh? Is it right? No, come on. It might miss it right. Don't get a kick. <laughs> it's not oh, over yet. I'm open. I'm open. That's just caught that edge. It hasn't. Oh. Yeah, I need that. That's what we need. <laughs> you want borrow rescue? Um, you give me a bit of hope there. Oh. Do you try and play a little draw then? Trying to like hit holding one into that left to right wind. It's strong though, isn't it? That well, it's not strong enough because mine stayed straight. Oh, Mine's oh, double crossed. So my shot there, obviously to hit a fade, you got to try and swing it left. But I've released it, haven't I? Call the double cross that. Not held on to the club face. <whistles> left. Not great. This is how I played last few days, isn't it? Just but like getting it up and down everywhere. Yeah, I think it's though. It's like. It's actually quite windy it's actually not the easiest no it's not moment. it's not this is not here. it's not been overly impressive by me this come on and i will say like i give him a compliment sometimes that like you have been playing good golf haven't you yeah i've been playing all right to be fair yeah it has looked just, really good i just feel like if i lose this though man, the head's gonna be off yeah i think you've missed the green though i think it's down to the chips Oh. oh no! No! <laughs> no! Yes! Yes! No! Yes! Oh no! That is taking a bounce off that bank. Go to the fifth bump! Get it! Oh no! I was convinced, absolutely convinced. They're probably two of the worst shots we've ever hit in our lives, but. Oh. Uh... No, I fatted it from 70 yards before. Oh, yeah. You played the wrong ball, though, so... Is that...? No, it doesn't matter. Oh, that is so disappointing. That's a 3-2 win for Waz. Your 3-1 up series. Oh, no, I'm losing. Losing ground. I'm going to go home, work on the track, man, all right? It's got a crack in it. I'm quite glad I broke it now. Annoying losing. To be honest with you, it wouldn't have been great if I had won that because I probably didn't really deserve to win that, to be fair. But you played the wrong ball, so it's probably like a draw. But the game puts you under so much pressure on every shot. And it just tests. I mean, it's, it's set out really to test your ball striking in every area. Got to get it good off the tee. Got to hit it good into the green. If you both miss them, your short game's got to be good. To be honest with you, it's the only game I've played where I felt like that sort of competition pressure over every shot. Yeah, well, like mine on the last end, I, I just had to hit the green. 
Are you but, just about did I don't know just about did that. But it's it gets you like that, like a certain times you need par to make but a cut down the last. Stop and speak here, put people yeah. off on the first tee. But yeah, that's a situation where you're gonna. Oh, you said he said to me right the other week. I'm gonna put this down because this is heavy. Good news. He said to me the other week, at some point you're gonna just have to hit the green to win. So that means I'm gonna win because you said that. Didn't oh yeah, that's you say that. Yeah. So at some point in your career, you're gonna win. So that's sound. When are you getting your amateur status back for like months? Don't be then? horrible about it. Playing like that puts you in a situation when you play an actual tournament feel less pressure because you kind of know you've always got a chance at par and if we were playing match play even if you miss the green like well can get up and down and halve the hole whereas no one halves a hole you have to hit the shot to win the hole so it's like I think when you can still sort of have that mentality if your short game's good well I can always make par even if I hit a bad shot it just doesn't count for this game does it? No. It's, it's constant. It's unbelievably simple it's good fun the other side of it as well, like we're just quite a lockdown, you've got to give the golf courses, you know, a little bit of leeway with the greens maybe and you know the condition. So, you know, you're not always going to be putting on perfect greens at the moment. So it's a great game just to actually be competitive and not worry about, you know, the surfaces and obviously like say give the golf course and the green keepers a bit of a break. It's a good point in the winter, isn't it, when people are doing work on the greens and stuff. It's a great game to play. But we'll I mean, we've been doing it every time we've been out, haven't we? Like and it's you, just competitive. You can do it and score as well, you know, you can carry on and put out and play that way, but yeah, we just like that because you get around quite quick, but um, it's annoying. Maybe we'll do another one of these in the next few weeks and update you if I can try and get back, but yeah, it's 3-1 in the series. And yeah, we might see you down the line. Oh no. Well, I'll see you next Tuesday. And I'll see you down the line. And I'll see you next Tuesday. Yeah, that'll do. Thank you. See you next Tuesday. See you down the line. Yeah, both Tuesday, of them. Tuesday's all line of them. Down the, down the all team. of them. All of them it is. Tuesday and line. Thank you. I'm back. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm back. I'm back. Look, it's fine. It's fine. Oh no. Oh dear. It's not so good.